For capillary or skin puncture, these are the following materials that you will need for the procedure. We have capillary tubes for collecting the sample and disposable lancets to create the puncture. Next, paraffin wax and clay sealant to prevent the sample from spilling. We also need alcohol and cotton for disinfecting the puncture site. And lastly, a sharps container for disposal of used lancets. These are the steps in performing the capillary puncture. First, choose an appropriate site for collection. The third and fourth finger of the non-dominant hand is usually chosen as a site of collection. Disinfect the site using a cotton wet with alcohol. As much as possible, remove the excess alcohol from the cotton. The manner of disinfecting the site must be in a circular fashion. Wait for the area to dry properly. While waiting, you can prepare the materials needed for collection. Remove the cover of the disposable lancet by twisting. This will expose the needle of the lancet. Hold the finger of the patient and perform a quick firm stab on the finger. Immediately discard the used lancet into the sharps container and wipe the first drop of blood using cotton. Make sure that the puncture site is perpendicular to the ridges of the finger. This is to ensure that a ball of blood is generated for easy collection. Fill the capillary tube with blood sample by pressing and releasing the finger of the patient. Fill two-thirds or three-fourths of the capillary tube and make sure that there are no bubbles or spaces seen after collection. The sample must be inverted to mix after collection. Repeat the same procedure in filling the next capillary tube. After which, perform patient care. Patient care involves applying a clean and dry cotton on the site of collection and instructing the patient to apply pressure until bleeding stops. The capillary tubes must be properly sealed with clay sealant first, followed by paraffin wax. Care must be exercised when sealing the tubes because when too much pressure is applied, the tubes might break. So there you have it, the steps for blood collection through skin puncture. Thank you so much for watching.